Padres are hosting the Giants. Tim Hudson starting for San Francisco. He gave up six runs and one plus innings his last time out. Meanwhile, Odrisa Merritt Despagne tries to snap a six start winless streak for San Diego. Bottom one, the Padres get right to work as they load the bases for Alexi Amarista. Line to right center field. That's a deep drive all the way to the wall. Well, at least it'll be cut off. One run scores. Two runs score and holding at third is Grandall. It's 2 0. The little ninja comes through again. Amarista has been hot of late. He has 10 RBIs in his last seven games. But the Padres don't stop there. The next man to step in is Cameron Mabin. He lines it to center field. Here comes Rondall around third. Amarista, the throw will be late. It's 4 to nothing. San Diego gives the Spagne an early cushion with which to work, and the rookie seems quite comfortable. Top two, Brandon Belt, will go down looking. In the third, the Spagne's counterpart, Hudson, will strike out swinging. Bottom three, now Seth Smith is at the plate for San Diego with a man at third base, and Smith will rip one down the right field line for an RBI double. Jed Jerko trots home, and the Padres extend to a 5-0 lead. Hudson was done after four and a third. Top five, Despagne gets some nice defense behind him. Gregor Blanco's at the plate. He'll ground one to the right side. Jed Jerko makes the sliding stop and throws Blanco out at first base. Everything is going right for the Friars. Top six now, pinch hitter Michael Morse will strike out swinging. And then Angel Pagan, who just came back from a bulging disc, will strike out as well. Six Ks in all four, Despagne. Top seven, Brandon Belt grounds one to second base. And Jerko makes the play again. Seven scoreless frames, just two hits and one walk. For for Despagne, the Padres blank the Giants 5-0. So Despagne does snap his six-start winless streak, and the rookie records his first victory since August 12th. The Giants, meanwhile, fall three and a half games back of the Dodgers for the top spot in the National League West. And with the Pirates winning Friday, San Francisco's lead for the top NL wildcard slot shrinks to one game.